Dan Willis here, and we're talking about credit financial services and how to negotiate a settlement payment. So first and foremost, you should only enter into negotiations after you've requested account validation and investigated the statute of limitations. That's the time period for which you are legally responsible for repayment. So assuming both of those are in line and in check, the next step is to negotiate a settlement. And this should first always negotiate to pay much, 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 much less. Typically, you'll be able to settle your account from anywhere between 10% all the way up to 40%. For example, if you have a $2,000 debt, you may be able to settle that account for just 20% or $400. Now, please, this is key. You must get credit financial services to agree that in exchange for your payment, they'll stop reporting your account information. You see, if you neglect to get them to agree to stop reporting your account. The only thing that's going to change when you make your payment is the status of that collection item on your credit report. It's going to be changed to a paid collection. A paid collection is not a good positive credit building item by any means. It's still going to damage and drag down your credit score. So this next part is the actual removing of that item from your credit report. If you have that agreement, you've made your payment, you next want to exercise your rights under the Fair Credit Reporting Act, the FCRA. This law, this legislation entitles you and gives you the right to dispute and challenge any item that's on your credit report that you believe is questionable, made an error, or inaccurate. You can file your dispute three ways. You can do it online, over the phone, or by mail. Once the credit bureaus get your dispute and they deem it valid, which is another conversation for another place, but once they, they, they're required to investigate the item and when they investigate it they're going to call credit financial services they're going to contact them and ask them for verification of your account as per your settlement agreement your account will not be verified during the credit bureau investigation and in accordance with the fair credit reporting act the credit bureaus must remove that item from your credit report now, it's not that simple, unfortunately. The Federal Trade Commission comes in on a regular basis and issues fines to all these collection agencies that are into the industry. Moreover, the Federal Trade Commission has even fined the three credit bureaus and more than once for violating consumer rights. This is Dan Willis. We're going to include a link in the description below over to an article on our website for the full story of dealing with credit financial services. We also have a free report available there. The seven proven ways to boost your credit score. Please subscribe and join our congregation. Have a wonderful day and looking forward to talking to you again here soon.